Thank you very much, I'm Pastor Alfonso Warali Chris. Here today to share the truth with you uh, from uh, the book of John 14, verse 6, which say, Let me read for you, friends. Jesus answered, I am the way, I am the truth. I am uh, the life. The only way to the Father is uh, through me. As my friends, you listen what the word of God is saying to you right now. He said, He is the way, He is uh, the truth, and uh, He is uh, the life uh, forever. Now, I try to ask you a question. As you see uh, me standing in the streets, then uh, in your mind, do you think that this road here is uh, Jesus Christ? As he meant to be the way, he tried to mean this kind of a road or something else. However, you say that he didn't mean this way but he also said he is the bread then I always see people in the churches refer him to the bread and they eat the bread but I've never seen a person refer him to uh, the road as you will see it naturally then uh, i want to see people drinking the blood they take wine and they symbolize uh, the blood of uh, jesus christ but uh, i've never seen a person walk in the streets mean that I'm walking in the way Jesus Christ while walking while going as you see me walking then uh, if you think that uh, he was not meaning this kind of a road but uh, you know that the bread he mean the bread the normal bread that you buy in a shop then uh, don't you think that there's something which is not right but you still continue doing it why the road is not a normal road but uh, the bread you use in the normal bread why the blood is not a normal bread normal blood why the blood is not spiritual blood but you use a normal blood that's the question what me i know jesus christ didn't mean the road here, which one you see, or the bread, which the, the bread, which one you buy in the shop. Also, you never mean the wine that you buy in the shop. You sometimes tell me, he said so to remember him. Let us use the bread and wine to remember him. The bread is the body. And, and wine to refer as a blood. Now the question again I'll ask you then, do you remember him only when you see the wine on the table? Or do you remember Jesus Christ whenever you see the bread on altar? If you say no, does that mean you're still wrong in doing in eating the bread in a communion in a communion day you have to now think about what exactly jesus christ mean and uh, stop symbolizing remember symbolism is idolatry however you symbolize something which supposed to be spiritual you do now what we call idolatry that is it you refer jesus christ 
to a, a statue. You build a statue of a, a Jesus Christ on the cross and honoring the same statue by thinking he, him the, that statue there. Then do you think that something foolishness in your mind now? Then where to get help? I wish you to come close. I invite you. I will show you exactly what the meaning of the way, what the meaning of the bread, what the meaning of the blood, what the meaning of the cross, so that you can use it in a good way. I thank you, friends, wherever you are, whoever will watch this video, find me and uh, we'll share. I'll explain everything to you who Jesus Christ is about. Jesus Christ is not a human being as you think. You, you refer him to a white person. It's not that we worship. Then come to me, I will show you the really Jesus Christ. As he mean when you drink my blood and you are saved. Then, but you always drink wine and you're still a sinner. You're still sinning. That means you're using something wrong. It's not the, 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 the blood of Jesus Christ. The blood of Jesus Christ gives power. But the, the wine makes people drunk. Can you see how you contradict now? The body of Jesus Christ brings power. But when you, you eat the bread, the bread is, is making your stomach full. Remember, Jesus Christ means everything that enters in our mouth go to the stomach, from the stomach to the toilet. Then uh, by it, the bread is goes here from the stomach to the toilet. Then do you think the body of Jesus Christ, uh, that bread you're eating, it goes here to the toilet, then uh, it's cleaning the, by entering your stomach, now it's cleaning your seeds in the body. See how wrong, see how still be, you're still, you're still in the wrong way. He means the thing from the mouth of a person are the which to save a person. Has killing, gossiping, idolatry, prostitution, witchery, hunger. What comes from you, from your mouth, is the thing that is saved for you not what enters then it means all the things that enter your stomach cannot even clean your sins whatever you you you, you drink 10 liters of a normal blood it will never clean your sin whenever you drink 10 liters of waters, it will never wash your sins. Whenever you eat, whenever you eat, 10 kg loaves of bread, they will never increase your power, but they will fill up your stomach. Remember, what I'm telling you, understand me. Uh, very well and come approach I will help you understand the scriptures as it says here the scripture kills but the spirit of the Lord bring life then you will waste your time reading and reading but you're still in confusion still in a deep confusion but whenever you come close to me I'll take out the, the veil on your face 
the blindness in you i'll take it out and you're gonna understand exactly the meaning of uh, the way the meaning of the bread the meaning of the water of life the meaning of the cross so on i thank you very much as you mean to understand my advice in the name of Christ Jesus I know we will meet one day face to face and the world will share this truth me and you and you you love Christianity thank you very much for all you listeners Amen <laughs>